What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. If you're new here, hi, my name is Samila TK. Welcome. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Q&A. So I asked y'all on my Instagram story, Q&A for my channel, Ask Away. So a lot of people, not a lot of people. So a few of you asked me some questions and I just want to say thank you for participating. Before we get into this video, don't forget to smash that subscribe button and hit that bell notification button so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. Now let's get started. Okay, so first question. What inspired you to start a YouTube channel? Okay, so I started doing my makeup back in 2016 and that was when a lot of people were posting like super glam eye looks and like super easy makeup tutorials and so I was like, I wanna do that too. You know, I wanna film my experience as well but because like I was so busy with school for the past five years, I never got a chance to start a YouTube channel. So I finally got the chance this year to start a YouTube channel just because the whole world went on pause because of the pandemic and so that's why I have a YouTube channel now. So yeah, basically I was already inspired to make a YouTube channel but I never got the chance to till this year, so yeah. Speaking of college and how I was so busy, somebody asked, what was the hardest part of college? Well, girl, honestly the hardest part was studying because you have to cram what you learn in those three weeks. My advice to you would to start studying in advance and study what you learned that day and go over it every day until your test and girl that will work i wish i did that but i didn't i was like super lazy and studied the last minute don't do that because it is really stressful when you try to cram everything and so yeah make sure you study in advance next question where do you get your makeup inspiration i get my makeup inspiration by these makeup artists that i follow and the art that i see on instagram what i do is i look at the palette that i'm gonna use and i'm like okay which three colors are you gonna use in your eye and so i just pretty much just freehand and just do it so yeah basically i'm inspired by other makeup artists okay so next question what made you start facebook lives and start your channel well i want to grow as a makeup artist so i thought filming and going facebook lives is a perfect way to practice on my face and get better throughout the years so that's why i decided to do that and honestly i've noticed a difference in my makeup routine my makeup is way better than last year girl like practice makes perfect so make sure if you want to be an MUA, make sure to keep practicing. Practice makes perfect, like I said. So keep doing it, girl. I promise you will definitely get better. Next question. What is your advice to a young makeup artist just starting? Well, that's me. I'm the, I'm the one that's just started. <laughs> well, my advice would be to just do it, girl. Don't be afraid of what anybody says. Just grab the camera, just start talking. I know I was a little shy when I first started talking to the camera, but just be yourself. Don't be afraid. People are gonna love you for who you are, you know? And honestly, if you're gonna start doing makeup videos on YouTube, on Instagram, on TikTok, literally, you don't need an expensive camera. I use the iPhone what is this an iPhone 11 and a ring light that's all I use um, so yeah you don't need anything expensive girl and so yeah I think that's pretty much it the last question of this Q&A is where do you see yourself in 10 years I see myself already working with the makeup brand I'm already gonna be the face of Morphe by that time I'm probably already gonna have three kids probably going on my fourth kid already gonna be married with Ricky and we're gonna have this big ass mansion i'm literally just manifesting this because i really think that's where i'm gonna be in 10 years i'm probably already gonna have my own business in makeup i really want to pursue my own makeup line Ooh, i'm so excited just thinking about it and so yeah that's where i see myself in 10 years damn now that i think about it going on a fourth child in 10 years oh my goodness that's scary <laughs> But we'll see what happens. Yeah, that's crazy. I can't wait till that happens. And that is a wrap for my Q&A. Thank y'all so much for watching. And thank y'all to those who asked me these questions. I really appreciate it so much. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button and hit that bell notification button so you get notified every time I upload a brand new video. See y'all in the next one.